Hi guys, here we are in the city of Lagos, Lake Phase 1 to be precise. And here we carried out an installation of 7 kilowatt power using uh, 14 units of 500 watt solar panels. And this installation took us about 5 hours. And the best thing we did is, you know, using one of the best solar panels for Yippee! this installation because the amount of appliances or the amount of load consumption in this house or in this office is like 8,800 watts. Though with time, we will still be adding another uh, uh, unit of 14, 500 watt solar panels to make it a total of, you know, 14 kilowatts. So this is the best direction we got to install our solar panels because sun rises from here and sets behind here. Sun sets here in the evening and rises here. So from morning, once it is six, seven, once the sun is out, these solar panels should be receiving the intensity of sunlight on them directly down to evening. So these solar panels should be harvesting at least 95% of their total energy because of the direction which they are. Aside these ones which are at the down level due to how sun rises, this might block you know, some of the cells from receiving power. For the rest, eight units which are above here, Will be receiving steady sunlight for the next uh, eight hours or the next seven hours so i'll take you guys down show you the amount of load this very place is consuming and show you the amount of battery and you know uh, the size of the inverter we use and down here we have two units of 5.5 kV inverters yohaku brand and each of them comes with an inbuilt charge controller of 100 amps if you can see this very one is carrying about 55 percent load and the whole panels is on this one because i didn't connect the other one so we are generating about 72.6 amps coming from uh, the solar panels then down here we have uh, two breakers one will serve the other inverter the other one will serve the other inverter and the spd which is such protective device then down here we have a bus bar that connects the two inverters to the battery this is the second unit of the 5.5 kV hybrid inverter. This one also have a 100 amps charge controller, but I didn't use the charge controller here because we have an intention of adding another 14 units of solar panels and another 15 kilowatt battery. And down here, we have a 14.4 kilowatt live pool 4 battery. This battery comes with 5 years warranty and the manufacturer recommends 80% depth of discharge. The battery is also soft touch you don't have to be pressing the hard button it will show you the amount of current coming from you know your solar panels when it's charging and it will be showing you the amount of current when you are consuming so the life expectancy of this battery is 10 to 15 years lifespan because it's a life pool for battery so this is the full setup 14.4 kilowatt life pool for 11 kv uh, inverter and you know a manual changeover here are some of the appliances that will be working on this 11 kV system. 4 unit of 1.5 horsepower smart inverter ECs, 14 unit of 30 watt track light, 1 unit of 1500 watt water heater, uh, 550 watt pressure pump and some of the uh, lighting point. This setup may not be perfect for this power consumption for now because we are just generating about 60% of the energy consumed here from, you know, the sunlight.